for a guy like you, my guess would be, you know, having King of Queens and shows like that allows you then to go do the things that you want to do. Yes. King of Queens is the reason that I was able to do stuff like Comedians of Comedy. Um, it gave me that a solid enough basis that I could go and do smaller clubs where I wasn't making a lot of money, but I was building the fan base that I needed. So I was very, very fortunate, you know, to have shows like that. But also... King of Queens was a blast to do. All the writers were stoners. They were always pulling <laughs> weird pranks. There's the one episode where they dared me to stand still in a scene. There's a scene where I'm in it, but I don't have any lines. So they went, do not move the whole scene. See if we can get away with it. See if anyone catches it. And there's a scene. I am completely immobile through the whole scene. And they were always like sneaking weird phrases in. And also just getting to watch Kevin James, Jerry Stiller, Leah Remini, they're such amazing TV actors, and that was something that I wasn't good at. TV acting is really hard. Very hard to make it look natural. Why? It's such an unnatural setting. It's so, each scene is its own little thing. Um, okay, cut, next setup, and you have to also then pause for the laughs, um, and, but make it seem like that's part of the conversation. It is a very unnatural art form that the truly great Actors, TV actors like Danny DeVito and Kelsey Grammer, um, and, you know, they, they can really, really deliver that and make it look so natural. It's very hard to do. And Kevin's one of them. Kevin, there are, there are moments in that show that he doesn't even have dialogue. Just the way that he reacts to things are so hilarious. 